All right, what's going on everyone? Another nice fall day out there. Again, it appears as if it's nighttime almost. It's not, it's actually like 2.20. Days are getting even shorter for another couple, another couple weeks here. Oh geez, actually it's like another four weeks, but never matter. We're on to check the body weight. Had some epic lasagna last night and today they made by my wife. She is an awesome cook. Let's see what we got here. All right, back to where it should be. It's good to see that. Bodes well for heavy squats, or just squats. Nice, all right. And then I already wrote it out, so we just go right into it here. Day 94, you already know what the body weight is. Squats, 365, question mark. Hopefully eight or more. Once I can get 12, we take a stab at the next step. You'll have to wait and see what the next step is. And then some front squats, and then some single leg calves. All right, let's get it. So back squats felt pretty solid. Just happened to be hitting over the five, six mark. Um, that's previously always where I've kind of gotten stuck. Um, and I've been back doing them for maybe four weeks now, not sure. Uh, but anyway, I, I, I'm seeing 405 for reps, hopefully within four or five weeks. Basically whenever I can hit 365 for like an easy moderate 10, or an all out 12, then I'll know all right, four or five, I can probably get five. Um, so, yeah, that's the plan. Front squats now, we're gonna do beltless with the uh, fat bar here. Again, just because I don't wanna unload and load. Hopefully, 10, we shall see. So leg stuff is complete. Probably gonna save calves for Tuesday. I'm gonna be adding, adding in an arm day. Um, 
with the farmer carries. It's midday because the farmer carries, it just gets too dark nowadays to uh, do them at the end of the workout. I don't want to, typically don't want to do them at the beginning because it's a pretty, pretty fatiguing movement. But anyways, um, more on the story there, the summation I guess is that there will be a sixth workout day on Tuesdays instead of the rest day. So we'll only have one boring rest day. I am very excited about that because I wanted to have just have just a uh, like a arm focused only day instead of just kind of fitting it in, you know, a couple sets here and there. Um, I think that'll help the growth. All right, so we're getting after it here. all the sets. I'll probably do three sets. 20-ish. I think that was 20. All right, and on to overhand. This out of here. Peace. So we reverse forearm curl. Sometimes you gotta angle the elbows out a little bit, otherwise it tweaks the wrists. I like to do thumbs over the top. Maybe this is a little more dangerous, but with the back grip, it just puts the wrists in a kind of a weird position. They're not lined up. That's it, at least for the documentation. I guess I'll do a couple more sets of this, do some decompress. Squats were solid, um, back squats. I'm, I'm guesstimating that my all in 500 pound deadlift for three on uh, Friday there probably, probably took a little energy away from the lower back. But the squats actually still felt decent. I think I just need to get some, some sort of safeties, like a box you know, on either side or, or something like that just because I feel like there's been times when I felt like I could maybe do another rep, but I don't want to have to deal with having to drop it. Um, it'd be just overall safer to have some safety. So maybe we'll see that next week on squat day, who knows? Thanks so much for uh, tuning in and thank you for 900, 900 subscribers onto a thousand. Peace.